Well, I'm, uh, I've spent my whole life uh, uh, in the labor movement, so I'm passionate about the things that impact on uh, workers and their families and communities. I've also championed the cause of, uh, of uh, people who, without power or without voice in the, the halls of, uh, of power, the underprivileged in our society. I'm going to talk about the practical experiences that, uh, that I've faced as a head of a, a major union, part of the leadership team for 30 years, national president for the past 16 uh, years. And I'll talk about the issues that are out there today and how difficult those issues are and that uh, the difference with the union is we're working on solutions to those issues. There's just so many issues out there that ideas is what's going to bring us ideas, innovation, uh, to deal with the, with the problems we face as a community and as a, as a country and as a, a planet. Absolutely critical. My legacy, well, I kind of leave that to others. I, all I've done is I've, I've loved what I was doing. I never get up in the morning and said, gee, I don't want to go to work today. I, I always had this passion for what I was doing. I always started the day by challenging myself about what I was doing. And that gave me the comfort level to challenge others, both in the labor movement, who were colleagues of mine who didn't like being challenged, like the status quo, uh, challenge the business community, challenge, challenge the political leadership in the country and, uh, and around the world on the issues were important to, um, uh, to work. Well, inspiring, inspiring the future is a great uh, theme. Uh, and my future is about trying to inspire young people like yourselves. Uh, to, to say that uh, one individual can make all the difference in the world. I'm proof of that. My message to young people is to have confidence in yourself, believe in something, and go after it, uh, and don't be afraid to compromise along the way because life is made of compromises.